I want you to take a look at this. This is carbon sheets. And uh, remember the topic says circle combined with other objects. This is a circle combined with a rectangle. Having this rectangle, having this place as, um, let me take it as 12, and uh, as the, the base, and having the height as 7. Now, we are told to find the area. This place, just call it, take it as they are all shaded. These are all shaded. So and you are told to find the area of the shaded portion. For me to find the area of this shaded portion is going to be the area of the rectangle. Then you subtract the area of the circle from it. Look at what I mean. We have this. And this is our circle. All these places are the shaded region. And we have here to be 12 and here to be 7. Now, what is the area of a rectangle? This is the area of uh, the rectangle of a circle. It be giving us pi r squared. This is the formula we use to get this simplified. Now, at this moment, we have this thing to be 12 multiplied by 7, then minus 22 over 7 times now there is something we cannot just write we, we cannot just write seven this seven concise rectangle but if you remember initially in my previous video at the second episode i told you people when i used this circle that once i split this circle down i shall be having the base of a triangle as half of as the half of the circumference of a circle and i told you people that the height of the rectangle simply means the, the the radius but in this point this is a full circle but this circle now is not just uh, it in itself this circle is inside you can see the space so the length of this cannot be the radius rather it will be the diameter the length of this should will be now the diameter of this circle that i'm having here therefore what should be my radius will be seven all over two at this moment. So I shall be having here 7 over 2 multiplied by 7 all over 2. Now at this moment, 84 minus 22 all over 7 multiplied by 7 all over 2 and the 7 all over 2. At this moment, this 7 can cancel out and these 2 into here will be having 11 and we'll be having um, 84 minus 11 times 7, then all over 2. And which will be giving us 84, 77 over 2. Which will result to 84 minus 38. Point five. At this moment, we'll be having 45.5 as our answer. Thank you so much for your audience. See you some other time.